to left, right to left. Okay, so pieces of equipment, stability ball, weights, barbell, ankle weights, light hand weights, a fit stick, a mat. If you don't have any of it available, don't worry, give me heels. Five minutes to warm it up. Right here. Happy Monday. I can really use this workout, I'm really sore. Go into the chest press. Open and close. Remember, we're just warming it up, so you don't need to take it really quick. You gotta let your body acclimate. Toe tap, Willow's outside. Robert. All right, keep the toe tap. Robert's gonna play ball with Bella. I got a lot going on here, you guys. <laughs> Robert came home from working out, decided he's gonna throw the ball for Bella. All right, I wanna tap and reach straight to the front. There we go. I got it. Just nice and slow. Let that body warm it up. Just reach in front. Shoulders melted away from your ears. Woo. Yeah. Now all we're gonna do is straight to the ceiling. We're not gonna bend, straight. Just warming it up. Thumbs touch your shoulders. Woo. Extra gentle today. We're saying good morning, good afternoon to our body. You gotta give it time to warm up. Don't ever just start jarring the joints or going into your workout. Whew. If you're nice and cold. Now, hamstring curl. Right here. Just shoulders up. Kick your heel to your butt. Whew. Looking good. Let's keep those hamstring curls. Let's circle. Right arm's gonna circle. Left hand on the hip. Kick your heel to your butt. All right, let's do that left arm. Circle, circle. Just doing it on the left side, starting to warm it up. Four, three, two, one. Squat, little squat. Mini squat, it's a baby squat right here. Sit back in your heels. Now give me heels, left to right. Chest press, whoo. Now you should be starting to feel a little warmer. Getting nice and loose. It should feel a little better now on the second time around. So cross your arms. Keep those heel taps. Right here. Keep those heel taps. Now toe taps. Up, down, up, down. Reach, reach. Good job, you guys. Now let's tap left to right. Thumb meets a shoulder. Right here. Just start turning in through the midline of your body. Let that hip turn. Let that hip turn. Get some rotational movement in through your midsection. Warming up in through your core so that thumb touches that shoulder. All right, let's cross our body. Thumbs up, cross, thumbs up. Whoo. Yeah, right here. Looking good, you guys. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna go straight up, and then we're gonna grab our step bench. Warm up's over, you had five minutes here. Hope you're nice and warm. We're gonna put our step bench in a vertical position. Grab that fit stick. Now grab your step bench, grab it. I'm gonna use one riser. Make sure your bricks are on. Head above the heart. You're moving. When you bend, 
hinging like from your hip. All right, you got that fit stick right here. Now I like to make sure, give it a little kick, march it right to left. Make sure that brick is totally on. All right, let's do a T-step. Now alternate the knees. Right T-step, it's on, off, on, alternate the knees. One T-step, on, off, on, now off. Alternate the knees. That simple. Now let's talk about the fit stick. Woo! What you're gonna do, do not take the fit stick past the crown of your head. All right. One more. So straddle on, off the bench. Now give me narrow squat, narrow squat. Now you can hold the fit stick right here, right here in the front of the crown of your head if you don't like to go straight, but keep a soft bend in your knee. Left T-step, left T-step. Alternate the knee. That's it, what you do on the right, you do on the left. Step it on, off, on, back. Then alternate the knee two times. You got it. Now when that knee comes down, that's when that fit stick comes down. Woo! Looking good. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. One more time. We're gonna go back into the narrow squat after the knees. Narrow squat. Now remember, you can have your fit stick here or up here, but I want a soft bend in the elbows. Your arms should not go behind your ears. Take it to this right side. Step knee, here we go. Step knee. We've done this before. So spear a fish, spear. Take that fit stick past your left butt cheek right here. Shoulders melted away from your ears. Core, nice, solid, tight. Whole foot on the bench, whole foot off the bench. Now let's talk. You don't have to have a fit stick. You don't have to have a step bench. Look, if I have no step bench, right here. So I'm mimicking step bench moves, but you don't have to do it. Over your bench, over your bench, other side. What you do on one side, you do on that other side, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Now, the key, spear the fish. Really, with that right hand, spear the fish. It's that rotational movement. Internal, external oblique work, cardiovascular, endurance work. Using that step bench, right? Little balance when you're stepping with a high knee. Yeah, yeah. Come on. Very simple, very basic, no repeat moves today. I don't want to make the moves hard. You got to be able to complete them, right? Yeah. Oh, march it on your bench, right to left. Right to left, I'm facing you. All right, again, you can have the fit stick here or you can have it. Eye gaze distance, down, down. Oh. Now again, here or here, hands, shoulder width apart. Basic straddle, right here. Get nice lateral movement in. Now you're also working back extensors. Core nice, solid, tight. A lot is going on here in this simple exercise. Remember, you put a bend, you take the bar to your forehead. You can still feel those back muscles engage, right? Or you can take the bar to your forehead, lift, hold, oh, come on, let's go. Oh. Feel that energy, guys. Feel the movement four and three, march it left to right. Guess what we get to do? 
left lead. Now press down, press up. As your feet come down, press the bar down. Heart rate's coming up. Guess what? You only have like three more exercises with the fit stick and that step bench. Basic, simple, easy to follow moves, right? So amp it up any way you want. Let's go. Yeah, baby. Feel it. Your upper body's gonna be toast when I'm done with you today. I said toast. You wanna put a little butter on that toast? <sighs> yes. Never miss a Monday, right? March on your bench, right to left. Right, left. Now we're gonna tap it. You can stay here. You're taking the fit stick, collarbone height, or out, in, out, press it back. Your choice. Hand shoulder width apart. Don't lock out your elbows. <sighs> Breathe it through. Now, you want more intensity? Hop. All right. You can absolutely ramp it up, you guys. I'm good where I'm at. I'll tell you what my heart rate is 146. I'm good. I don't need to ramp it up. I'm listening to my body today. I didn't mean to go heavy weightlifting yesterday, but I did. <laughs> On your bench, left or right. Now, instead of pressing forward, we're gonna press in front. Let's get that tap. Left, right. What you do on the right, you just lead on the left. Now, we can add up, up. Technically, it's no repeat because we're switching lead legs. Hup. Yeah. Oh. Very basic and simple. Really focus. Take it up a notch. Stay where you're at. Slow it down. Your call. Each exercise, 60 seconds. Marching on the ground, right to left. Right here, up, forward. It's a curb walk, you guys. Up, forward, up, down, up. Take the bar forward, up, down, up, forward, up, down. Hand shoulder width apart. Bar up, forward, up, down. Curb walk it. We're gonna do this on that left side. Then we're moving on to light hand weight, boxing for 10 minutes. I will have two pounds hand weights in my hand. Whew. Up, forward, up, down. Up, forward, left to right, march. Ready, go. Up, forward, up, down. Left, lead, leg. Up, forward, up, back. Up, forward, up, down. Up, forward, up, press it down. Up, forward, up, down. Hoya! Come on. I'm saying, Angie, you got this. Two more cardio sessions to push. You're strong, you're determined. You got this. Feel that life energy your body's giving you. Let's move it. Let's groove it, people. One more. We're gonna put that fit stick, small swig of water, put it away. March, march. Head above the heart. See how I grab? Get my equipment out of the way. Small swig of water, light hand weights. 
Come with me when you're ready. Light hand weight boxing. Now, we will not be kicking. That is kickboxing. We are doing boxing. Jabs, crosses, hooks and uppers, right? Come on. Now, if you wanna go a little more and you wanna ramp it up, because today's steady state cardio, guess what? You can box or shuffle and then jab. I have two pounds in my hands. I'm good with that. Shoulders melted away from my ears. Core nice, solid and tight. I'm gonna focus on my jabs at 12 o'clock. Each 60 seconds, we do a different exercise. How about that? Yeah, I know you can do it. Oh, now you're gonna cross, cross right here. Cross the midline of your body. Shoulders melted away from your ears, working that core. If you have that weighted vest on, oh yeah, you're really feeling it. Cross, cross. Shoulders melted away from your ears. Let that lower body come with you. Don't do this. You're getting nothing out of this. Let that lower body and those hips lead. Because if you were really boxing, your whole body would be helping you. You would not be doing this. Man, I could take your punch all day long. Now, what if I add my lower body? Right? You got to generate the energy from your lower body up. Boxing is just not swinging your arms, people. Hook right to left. Now, again, that lower body gets involved. I'm sliding my underarms on a bookshelf. I'm turning in through my midsection. I'm hitting the side of somebody's face. Palms down, my knuckle is landing in the side of their face, yeah? This is your hook. Again, your shoulders are not hiking up into your ears. Great core work here as we're working that spinal rotation. Your internal and external obliques are grabbing. Your transverse abdominus is really kicking in. That's the deepest layer of your core. Very simple, very basic. You gotta give me the energy. Come on. Now this is nothing. What the hell is that? Oh, come on. Uppercut, upper. Again, it's not. Now look, you gotta get the upper body. Get under their chin. Now your elbow does not go behind you. Take it to your side of your hip and then get under their chin. Right there, from the side. Oh, look how I get my lower body involved. Core working. Oh, that little uppercut is coming away from my body, landing underneath their chin. You got that? Intensity with boxing. Your whole body is working. Yeah? Come on. Got it. Very basic, very simple. I'm giving you plenty of time to work on this. Get that. Get under their chin. Under their chin. Under their chin. Right, jab, cross. Jab, cross. Whoo, shoulders melted away from your ears. From the side, looks like this. Jab, cross. As I do that back cross, my back hip comes with me. I'm not doing this, look. My back hip pivots forward with that back cross. Because if I'm gonna hit them from behind, you can't hit them from behind like this, you guys. You gotta uh, use your body. Whew, I told you. I'm not gonna leave your body. We're gonna really work that upper body and a core focus in these boxing moves right here. Come on, jab, cross. You can do it, jab, cross. Now, if that's too fast for you, put the weights down or jab, cross, jab, cross. Your choice, how fast or how slow. Hoop. Now left side, hook up or slow. 
hook, upper, hook, upper, hook, upper. Yeah, I started on that left side. Hook, upper, hook, upper, hook, upper, hook, upper. Hook. So that back arm is really, huh, you are hitting the side of someone's face and under their chin. Two separate punches. Hook, upper, hook to the side of their face. Upper, get under, huh. bam, huh. Come on, you guys, you only got four more minutes. And we're gonna grab that stability ball. You can do it. Slide your arm on that bookshelf. Shoulders melted away from your ears, right? You're really engaging the core, really working the upper body and getting your cardiovascular workout all in one session. Jab, cross, here we go. I'm gonna start slow. Jab, cross, jab, cross. Now, if this feels good to you, I'm gonna ask you to stay here or speed it up. You did this on the other side. I'm showing you that slower option. Now again, remember, jab, cross. This may be the tempo you like. Or jab, cross, jab and cross. Your call. Oh. Come on. You wouldn't believe it, but man, you get a great cardiovascular workout through boxing. Hup. Shoulders melted away from your ears, core engaged. When you do that back cross, that back entire body has got to pivot to really pack power to your punch. Four, three, go to the right, hook upper. What? Yeah, you did this on the left. You got to do it on the right. Hoop. Woo! Hook, upper. Side of the face, uppercut. Side, under. Melt your shoulders away from your ears. Come on. You got it. Two more exercises. With boxing, that's it, you guys. Going by quick, right? No repeat Monday. Man, we are really challenging our cardiovascular endurance to move in many different ways. We started with the fit stick, started with the step bench, going into boxing. We're gonna finish with stability ball cardio. Yeah, no repeat Monday, loving it. Nothing better than a no repeat. All right, here we go. Jab, cross, jab. Jab, cross, jab. One, two, three. One, two, three. Right foot steps to the left. Little pivot. One, two, three. One, two, three. Just step to the left. Step center. Step to the left. Step center. One, two, three. Jab, cross, jab. Jab, cross, jab. Jab, cross, jab. Hup. This is it. We only have the other side. Jab, cross, jab. Hup. If you don't like the pivot turn, stay to the front. You don't have to pivot turn to the left. So if I were to the front, jab, cross, jab, tap. Right there. All right, other side, jab, cross, jab. Other side and we're done. Hook. This is it. Jab, cross, jab. Jab, cross, jab. That left foot is pivoting to the right. Now, if I don't like to turn, look, it can be a no turn, no dizzy Monday. Yeah? Right here. Jab, cross, jab. Jab, cross, jab. Core nice, solid, tight. Shoulders melted away from your ears. Hoop. Let's go. Come on. Yeah, working it. Hoop. One more each side. We're gonna put the weights up. Grab your ball. Grab your ball. Ooh. Are you ready? Get down, bounce. 
Y'all like that bouncing? Let's go. Let's take our hands over our heads. Let's wave them side to side. How about that? Come on. Feet hip width apart. Let's bounce on that ball. Oh yeah, I don't care how fast. I don't care how high. Woo, hands. Touch that side of the ball. Let's get those hands involved. Whoop. Looking good. Try to get your butt cheeks off that stability ball. Come on, let's bounce. Yes, you're getting your cardiovascular workout in. When you use those hands and you're bouncing, trust me, you're getting it in. We're just having fun with it, peeps. Come on. Okay, now circle your arms. Yes, no repeat. We're still bouncing. We're circling our arms in and out. I'm gonna do different hand movements. Woo! Keep that bounce. Go as quick or as slow as you wanna go. Shoulders melted away from your ears. Core engaged. Yeah. Now, if you don't have a ball, you're marching. You're still doing the same arm movements, people. You can march or you could jog doing these arm movements, right? You don't have to have a ball. You're gonna use what equipment you have available to you. You're gonna modify and you're gonna make this workout work for you. Yeah, I know. Come on, Judy. Come on, Kathy, Marsha, Jacqueline, and Diane. Come on, let's go. Arms, Woo Let's do our palms facing forward. Now I'll tell you, look, my heart rate is 148 and I'm bouncing on the ball. Anytime I'm doing really big, big arm movements right here. Who says you have to do all your cardio from a standing position? No, you can do a whole cardio class seated. The key is to keep the bounce. Try to get your butt just slightly off that stability ball. Really make those arms work. Exaggerate that arm movement. Oh, you got it. Oh, it's a bouncing stability ball type of J. Oh yeah. Oh, come on, let's go. Oh, are you ready? Arms forward, back. Give me a little clap. Oh, are you keeping that bounce? Don't worry, you guys. You only have two more exercises. And then our boutte will not bounce anymore. Are you doing really super big arm movements? Are your shoulders melted away from your ears? Yeah. Are you controlling your motion and your movement? When you're bouncing on the ball, that core has to engage. Yeah. Happy Monday, people. Come on, come on, come on. Oh yeah. Oh, see my bounce? I'm getting bigger with my bounce. Move that bounce if you want. Let's go. Ah, yeah. You gotta listen to your body. You go where you need to go, people. Yeah, two more minutes and we are done with cardio training. Oh yeah. Woo. Right here, open. Right hand comes on top, left hand comes on bottom. How about that? Oh, yeah. Right hand on top, left hand on bottom. Like you are pulling taffy. Like you're pulling taffy. Right hand up, left hand down. And you're keeping that bounce. Oh yeah, are you feeling it? Woo, are you ready? Left hand pulls taffy. Left hand, all I did was switch. Left hand pulls the taffy up. Right hand comes down. Squeeze a lemon in between your shoulder blades as your left hand and your right arm, left and right arms come in opposition. Yeah. Oh. Come on, bounce, bounce. Are you ready? You're gonna stand up. Really quick, give me hamstring curl. I don't care if it's right or left. 
bounce it right, left, right hand, left hand, right hand, left hand. Yeah, baby. Work in that coordination. Right, left, right, left. Just give me a hamstring curl. Right bounce, left bounce. Coordination big time. Come on. Let's go. Right here, right hand, left hand. Now, just march or step touch. Go right hand, left hand, right hand, left hand. Go as fast as you can. Walk it around, I don't care. Working on coordination. Right hand, left hand. Eye hand coordination work. You're marching any way you want, up back, down, heel, center. Fast, like you're dribbling a basketball. Right hand, left hand, right hand, left hand, right hand, left hand, come on. Come on, fast, fast, faster, faster. Four, three, two, one, put it away. Oh, walk those fingertips away from your body. Oh, walk your heels into your butt cheeks. Feel your hips open up. Relax, release. Man, one hour <laughs> goes by so quick. Are you ready? Upward facing dog. Pop your head out of the turtle shell. Pop your head, press through the pads of your hands. No tension in those head, neck, or shoulders. Feel your abdominal region, your hip region. Feel it all relaxing. Child's pose one more time. Did a lot of work today. Really, each time, melt it back. Feel the opening. Feel the elongation. Upward facing dog one last time. Oh, yeah. Got to pop your head out of that turtle shell, people. Elongate is the name of the game. Okay, let's get some spinal rotation cat-cow stretch. Up and down, working on spinal mobility. Your timing. Last time. All right, pick a side, any side. Oh, I love this stretch. Open, eye gaze to the ceiling. Point that top leg, just feel the opening. If you're too tight in your neck, your eye gaze can be forward. And just rock and roll to that other side. Two and a half minutes, guys. Let's get this done. All right, we're on our knees. Grab that right wrist. Up, come over. Let's do some stretching from a kneeling position. Grab that left wrist, lift up, expand through the rib cage, and then come up and over. Elongating opening is the name of the game, right? One more time, grab, grab the right wrist, lift, elongate, then come over. Feel that rib cage lifting. Lift, or grab that left wrist, lift, up and over. Chest expansion, interlace your fingers. Drop the shoulders away, look over your right shoulder. Shoulders down, look over your left shoulder. Shoulders back down and away. Chest expansion, open up. One more time, look over your right shoulder. Look over your left. Right ear, right shoulder. Left ear, left shoulder. Don't hike your shoulders up. One more time, right ear, right shoulder. Left ear, left shoulder. Last minute, one leg forward. Fingertips to the ceiling. Open, expand through the rib cage. Eye gaze to the ceiling. Open, open, open. Take the hand down. Spinal rotation, lift. Ah, 
other leg forward lift expand rib cage opening lungs you should be able to breathe nice and open shoulders melted away from your ears elongate release let go hand on the ground spinal rotation take that leg back walk back on your toes nice calf stretch if you can right here try to take your chest to your knees forward fold stretching out the back side of our body putting a soft bend in your knees when you need to saying yes no just letting your muscles of your head neck go release Hands on top of your thighs, inhale. As you exhale, roll it up. Deep breath in. Come to heart center. Rebalance. One more breath and we're done. Big inhale. Let go of your day's stress. As you come to heart center, balance, rejuvenate, unwind, de-stress. We are done.